Hello guys and welcome to How to Socials. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can download Fortnite or PC on your Mac uh, in 2020 after the August update, okay? So let's hop directly into it. What you wanna do as a first step is go to Google or whatever browser you are using and search for Fortnite. I search for Fortnite, yeah. So make sure it's the www.epicgames.com website. Click on this one. And what you, do, what you need to do next is very, very easy. All you have to do is press downloads here on the top right corner, the yellow button. They're asking us, how would you like to play? Now, if you wanna play uh, on PlayStation, Xbox, Nintendo Switch and mobile, please leave me a comment down below. I can create a tutorial on how to how to download Fortnite on those devices. But today we are here for playing on PC or a Mac. So select PC or a Mac. Next step, you would like to sign up or log in or sign in. Now, if you have an account, you can easily go to sign in or if you don't have an account, you can create one with your email, Facebook, Google, Xbox Live, whatever you may be. So for right now, I'm, I'm just gonna sign in. Give me a second one, say sign in. So I don't really wanna see your, my credentials. Okay, so right after you created your account or you have signed in, what a pop up like this will show. Thank you for downloading. Uh, if you don't fail to start, try again. Download for Windows, Mac, Android, okay? So they have detected that I have a Windows device. So I have already received an Epic Games installer. Just press on this one. If it doesn't work, just press on those icons. Let me show you what, what's gonna happen. So it will be like Windows and it will start again. If you have a Mac, press Mac. If you have Android, press Android. So then you need to go to Epic Installer. Uh, you need to select uh, where you want it to be. Let, I can just keep it like this. Then give it a time to install, which is gonna take not so long because uh, now, now this is not up to your internet connection or something like this. This is only up to your device because you already have the, the launcher. A lot of people think that this is, oh, you need to have internet good connection. It's more up to your device because uh, you already have the installer in your computer, right? So right after you would need an internet connection, of course, because they're gonna open, as you can see right here, Epic Games Launcher. They will uh, download the update, as I told you, August 2020, there was an update, and now it's a bit different, but uh, let's give it a little bit of time to download, which is gonna take a few seconds, I don't know. Okay, so right after it is installed and you log in once again, all you need to do is press the ticks button, I have read and agreed, go accept. Okay, so once you've accepted those, you can come here to browse, search for Fortnite, uh, and you can see it's free, press on this one, it's owned already, but you have to get it. Next step is install. So make sure you install and here choose install location. Now be very careful because if you have an SSD, I wouldn't recommend you to install it until it's very big because you will need around 100 gigabytes of memory. So in this case, C is my SSD. So I'm, I'm gonna use D folder and now I'm gonna press install. Um, now, as I said, it's, it's a pretty big game. So we'll have to wait a bit until uh, uh, until it's uh, it's finished. But as you can see, you can here press install and then all you need to do is wait. You will have a bar right here. Uh, this is not what we're looking for. It's 1%. So after you do all this, you are done. Like this is the whole process. You can see, you will have to wait, I don't know, it's up to your computer and to your internet connection around, I don't know, 10 to one hour, maybe two hours for the lower end computers and lower end internet connections. But after this, if you have your Fortnite account, if you ha have installed and follow all the steps correctly, all you need to do now is enjoy your game and play. Cheers, guys. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment what tutorials should I do. Cheers.